Good morning. Today I am out here checking out some slabs that I started working on a couple of days ago. So they were too wet when I first rolled them out. I wrapped them up too well so they're still too wet. So we're going to do some stuff around the studio and turn on the fan. Ooh. Let me finish first. And hopefully these will dry and then I can get back to work on that. guess is some sort of bug or critter was moving around in the ceiling and now I have dust on my table. So, gotta clean that up. Alright, I think we're ready.
on this second slab that I made to dry. Uh, got the fan going on it. You know how when you're cooking, if you're waiting on something, you should clean dishes while you're waiting to make cleanup at the end easier? That's kind of what I got to do right now because I'm waiting for that slab to set up and be ready. So I'm just going to mess around with the rest of the clay until it's ready. slabs put together on the main body. I need to wrap this up for a while because we've got two different wetnesses. This portion is pretty dry, so it doesn't want to go anywhere, but this portion bends really easily, so I want that to even out. So if I wrap that in a big bag, the moisture content will sort of even out throughout the clay. I've got to leave it for a while. I'm going to go ahead and roll out some other slabs for other parts of this pot. Bubble. I spritzed a little water on the drier portion of the pot. 
pot, that allows the air and moisture to move back and forth freely. And then I'm actually going to leave this overnight, so that way it has time to homogenize. this pot set up overnight. Oh, I need to put this away. Yeah, I need to put that away. And then I've got my slabs rolled out for tomorrow. Profile one, profile two, and profile three. But this is all the clay. That's all of this black clay that I have left. So I'm gonna, no. Do some other stuff uh, around the studio before. So we're gonna turn on the fan.